All right, welcome to Jam Box Breaks, tw uh, 29th of February, last day of February, 1.12 p.m. Eastern Time. We're doing uh, two uh, 2015 Elite Extra Editions here for Bradley. Thank you, sir. Good luck. I will, man. Did you look at the checklist to see the, uh, the different hot boxes there are? Oh, just like... Uh, I don't remember how many we pulled so far, but there's five hot boxes of 10, 10 hits, 10 autos plus a relic. There's seven of eight. There's five with uh, the top prospect auto. And then there's three with the uh, with the cool uh, patch autos. So there's a lot of different there's a lot of different uh, correlations in these. We pulled a couple out of them, obviously. We've done half the case so far, but we haven't really gotten too many huge names yet. I think we got a Brennan Rogers. I can't remember. I've done two of these now, so I don't remember what we've gotten out of this one. There's 20. Twenty in a case, so this is our second case. Hope so. Hope we get you a monster. We did pull a Meadows one one so far. We haven't pulled a dual auto yet, though. We pulled one in the first case. The dual auto is a father and son auto. We have not pulled that yet. I think you got one of the uh, one of the patch autograph boxes. I don't think Griffey's in this one now. You definitely got one of the patch hot boxes, so you got one of the three of those. We get autographed patches. All right, Raphael Devers. First up, you got Mike Navorak out of 150 on the dot cut. Next dot cut, you got Gregory Guerrero out of 150. Are you lagging at all? Or are you good? No breakers has been really slow lately. All right, USA Baseball of Nicholas Quintana, number thirty-two of fifty on the dual relic auto. Nice hit. Cool. Yeah, a couple of people have been having issues, and I know it's not my end, and I keep trying to tell them that. A lot of people are having are doing all right. I don't know why they're lagging, but it's definitely not me. Quintana kind of looks like Derek Jeter's signature. Cornelius Randolph, blank. All right, we got a Jordan Butler relic. You get one of these per, per box. Next auto, you got Taylor Ward, Los Angeles catcher. Nice hit. Taylor Ward in a die cut auto. Next up, we got Justin Garza, pitcher for Cleveland. What do you mean he was horrible? He he went crazy. I told him not to. He didn't do so well. He's been on a hot streak, though, so I hope he comes back this week because I need him. Danielle Carbonell out of 200 on a die cut. Oh, yeah, his connection's been, it's been like that for like two weeks, man. It, it's it's everyone in Illinois that's having issues. All right, here you go with Ryan Ripken. Ryan Ripken, Cal's son. It's the second one I pulled in this case. I didn't pull any in the last one. 
He's a guaranteed major leaguer, but just because of his dad. <laughs> I keep getting that uh, message saying high CPU usage detected, so hopefully this doesn't go out on me. Magnelia Sierra? I don't know why I keep saying that. All right, Jose Lopez for Cincinnati. Is he uh, owed? What's oh good? Eh, he's all right, but his he'll, his dad will get him in the majors. I I was PCing him for a while until I saw his numbers. <laughs> he'll definitely come up. All right, Sean Newcomb. Whoops. Oh, I thought that was going to be an auto of Mancada. Would have been nice. All right, we got Jake Wolford, St. Louis pitcher out of 75 on the die cut. Mancada would be nice. All right, Victor Robles for Washington, numbered 7 of 10. Victor Robles. Uh, I do my research on these guys, man. That's how I know. Before I buy any products, I research. Make sure it's worth it. All right, Walker Bueller. Plus, a lot of these guys were in the, uh, that leaf that we were doing. John Harris out of 100. Yeah, the checklist for this is badass. A lot of good hits. All right, we got Kyle Zimmer. Nice patch. Number to 25. Nice little patch auto. Kyle Zimmer. Like I said, there's only three of these boxes in a case that has these. So you got one of them. Nice hit. Where's the 130s at? I know I got a bunch sitting here. I'll have to sleeve that when I'm done. I don't think I have any 130s sitting here. Do I? used. I'll save that when I'm done. All right, and Chris Betts. Box one, let's go on to box two. Uh, Kyle Zimmer? I'm not sure. He's a Kansas City pitcher. I know Bradley Zimmer's good. I don't, I don't know if I've heard of Kyle Zimmer. A lot of these guys are still in college, man. Just draft it. A lot of them are going to have to hold on to. Um, there are some that are already almost ready to come up. That's why you get so many hits per box. Good deal, though. I mean, a lot of these guys, they paint out. I'm getting all these autos for a cheap price. It's better than spending all that money on a Bowman box and hitting one auto, and hopefully it's a good one. <laughs> yeah, Swanson's in this. All the all the top prospects are in this. Swanson, uh, Kyle Tucker, Minkata, Brennan Rogers. All those guys are in this. And there's five boxes with a guaranteed auto of one of them. I think last case we had Mankata, we had Brennan Rogers, we had uh, Swanson. Yeah, I, I agree, Bowman. Bowman doesn't suck, but you gotta you gotta hit the right guys. It's not worth the money. Not for not for buying them yourself. For breaks, for breaks it is if you hit the guys. I just ordered three cases of mini chrome football. I'm gonna do a three case break maybe. I got that Wednesday. I got a bunch of immaculate coming Wednesday, immaculate football and baseball. You shouldn't. Go look at what the hell the mini all uh, stuff's selling for. It's selling better than the regular. All right, no more Mazzara. All the all the numbered autos and stuff and the numbered colors sell a lot better than the big. All right, Christian Stewart for Detroit. Number to 100, he's decent. 
He plays for the Longhorns. Plus, it'll be three case to get, get a lot of hits with it. DJ Stewart. All right, Josh Naylor. He's good out of 150 for Miami. He's their number one prospect. Not an auto, though. Just die cut. That's because it's Golden Tate, dude. No one cares about Golden Tate. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got Jordan Hicks. Jordan Hicks out of St. Louis. Nice. Golden Tate's good, though, but he doesn't sell well at all. All right, Jake Wolford for St. Louis on the gold. Four of five. Jake Wolford, St. Louis pitcher. Four of five. There you go, sir. All the numbers sell. Yeah, I did pull the nailer for you. I remember that. I pulled a bunch of his. All right, we got Swanson. Next up from Milwaukee, he's decent. Nathan Kirby out of 100. All right, Josh Stamont out of 200 for Kansas City. All right, your relic. We got Brennan Bogerie. Brennan Bogerie. We got Manuel Margot out of 200 on a die cut. You know who he is. Come on, hit three wet. Yeah, I'm down to another one. Corey Seeger. All right, Rendell Medina. Rendell Medina for the Reds. We got Cody Ponce. Cody Ponce had a 100 from Milwaukee. I'm doing box wars today with Supreme. Buy a box and then, uh, 16th box that someone's going to get for free. There you go, sir. Julio Urias. 9 of 10. Nice hit. You got one of the top prospect boxes. Julio Urias, 9 of 10. Huge hit. Nice hit, man. Marcus Molina. There you go. You still want to do another box? All right, so we got one auto in that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, you got seven, which is the top prospect box because you got one of the top prospects. Yeah, good box, man. Jake Wolford out of five and Urias out of ten. Good box. Okay, let me grab another one. Box three. Grab some more top loaders. I gotta clean up my floor. All right, good luck, man.
Вообще. You're not working today, man? Or did you work last night? Uh, Supreme just released today. I'm waiting for the case to come, but it's uh, it'll be box wars. It'll be 15 spots. I think I got to do it at 105 a spot. Each person gets a box, and then whoever has the lowest number card pulled will get the 16th box free. So, yes, they're paying higher than retail for a box, but someone's getting a free box out of it, so I got to compensate for that. But I didn't get a deal on that case at all. I had to pay retail for this stupid thing. Ridiculous. But each person will have a box. And then uh, whoever has the lowest number card, I'm giving them the 16th box for free. Thanks, bud. But I'm only posting it in the room. I can't let anyone use coupons on that. Because I can't lose my ass on that, too. I lost my ass on black gold big time. Alright, we got Jarrell Cotton. Pull him all the time. I'm not sure if he's good, but he's a Los Angeles pitcher. Jarrell Cotton. Next up, we got uh, Corel Prime for Colorado. Corel Prime, first baseman. All right, Kyle Schwarber, Austin Allen out of 200. Yeah, I mean, it happens sometimes, man. That's what happens when you offer nice stuff to people. Everyone tends to use it at the same time. <laughs> happens all the time. Mitchell Hansen, Los Angeles. That's why, in a way, I'm kind of glad it might go away. <laughs> I mean, I'll still do the $30 credits, but... The the other one, it's, it's actually killing me. I'm not busy enough. All right, Zach Irwin for Chicago. He's good. Zach Irwin. I believe he was a second rounder. I can't remember. Blink. All right, Anthony Hermillion. He's good for Houston. It's one of their catching prospects. Jake Wolford again for Seattle or uh, St. Louis. I think this is your third one now. You got the gold and then two, a numbered and I think a base. Start getting his rainbow now. <laughs> All right, Julio Urias. Blank. Next up, Wee Chang Huang. All right, we got a Tristan Casas on the relic. Some of these are numbered with some color in them, too. Not too many of them, but there's a few in the case. Werber. Omar Carazales out of 150. All right, Yoan Mencada out of 150. Nice die cut. Yoan Mincada. All right, Drew Finley for New York. Drew Finley for New York out of 100. 
Yeah, I'm fine, man. I'll keep going. It don't matter. You want to do another one? We can do another one. All right, Harrison Bader for St. Louis out of 50 on the die cut. These are addicting, man, all the hits you get. That's why Moats went from 2 to 12 to one night. Carl Wise out of 100. Uh, Sox or Cubs, I don't, I'm not sure. They don't tell you on here. It just says Chicago. This guy's for Toronto. Aaron Nola. Let's see what box you got for this one. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think you got one of the eight auto boxes. Eight, nine. What do you got in ten? I don't remember. I know Christian. Actually, Christian Stewart's good. Christian Stewart for Detroit. I don't know how many he had in that one. I think it was eight. Plus the relic. All right, let's do one more. This one's going to have a monster, I have a feeling. Box four, Bradley. Bowman Sterling still tonight, so get rid of that. Still have two boxes of it, but get rid of that and get rid of all this other baseball I got sitting here. I really thought that mixer was going to fly. That thing went so slow. It's actually a really good mixer, too. I don't have any more immaculate to make another one. Yeah, there's a ton of hits in this. Target's got retail ones of these, but they've been shitty. A lot of points. People have been showing me. I'm like, you're paying $30 for three autos, and you're not getting those guarantees in a case. Granted, yeah, it's $30, but you're not hitting the big boys. And you're getting a lot of points out of them in place of your hits. You're not going to get case hits in those. This one looks like a lot of hits, so I think you got one of the 10 hit boxes. You see a lot of backwards cards. So it's 10 autos plus a relic. Could be wrong, but I'm seeing a lot of backwards cards. Yeah, Gurley's nice, man. Yeah, I already, I already shipped it to you. I would have saved it. I had to, I protected it, and unfortunately, those are too big for top loaders because of the big shadow boxes. All right, Stephen Brout for Pittsburgh. Wish they made top loaders that big. I don't know why they don't. One touch of scratch those cards too. Luis Ortiz, Orlando Arcea, Arcea. Yeah, they're huge. All right, Sky Bolt. He's good for Oakland. I pull a lot of him in this. Sky Bolt. All right, Andrew Suarez for San Fran. Andrew Suarez. Chad said he's good. I don't know, though. I don't know anything about him. He's the San Fran guy. He knows. All right. We got Zach Irwin, who's good for Chicago. I think Irwin is, I think Irwin is a uh, White Sox, if I remember. I could be wrong, though. He might be a Cubby. Nice. 
well, from Douchebag, Manuel Margot out of 150. Because every single one of his grades are coming back as fours and fours and sixes and eights, and they've been terrible. It's because he didn't pull that card. If he pulled the card, he don't treat it good. That's why all his cards are coming back the way they are, because he doesn't treat them nice. He throws them around on his desk. I've watched it. Leotis Tavares out of 200. That's why everyone's getting shitty grades on surface, man. It's the only way it can happen. He just throws them around. Nice. All right, Cabrian Hayes. He was a first rounder out of 200 for Pittsburgh. Didn't get an insert auto coming up. All right, Richie Martin. Joshua Stamont out of 150 for Kansas City. Oh, you shouldn't have gotten that, man. That's that's retarded to have that on your card. I wouldn't want that on my shit. All right, Nick Plummer and Jake Wolford. There you go, a dual auto, 23 of 25. I know Wolford's good. You might as well start PC and Wolford, man. <laughs> Got a whole bunch. There you go. Nick Plummer's basically good, too. Nick Plummer and Jake Wolford on the Elite Duel. Nice hit. All right, Gregory Guerrero. Not Vlad's son. His name is Vlad as well. Yeah, I wouldn't want that on my grade. That would piss me off. Vlad Guerrero, Jr., all right, you got Bryce Denton, who's good for St. Louis. Bryce Denton. I grade my own stuff, man. I don't trust anybody. <laughs> Switch out or handle it correctly. Labor Therese. I don't know how you get a four. Why, why would you even send that card in? Crazy man. All right, Jason Gooseman. Jason Gooseman, Kansas City. Yeah, there's a lot of St. Louis in here. There's a lot. All right, and CJ Brown on the relic. Good boxes, man, for sure. Yeah, I don't, I don't even know why he would even attempt sending in something that grades that. You have to see something. He's not looking at the backs either, man. He's just telling everyone that they're nice to grade. Oh, this clean surface. Oh, you got to look at the backs, too. You got to look at centering on the backs. That makes a big deal. Um, We've pulled uh, – the whole case has been good for Chrome. We pulled – um. let me uh, end this video.